LTC, we start with one hour chart. If we refer to our analysis in my last video, we mentioned if we get any trade set of a buy from here, we can take the trade. Anyway, as what we expected, the price moved, but we didn't get a really good trade setup to look for buy and even based on 15 minutes. All right. Unless someone get a trade from here or having a trade above the top. Anyway, whoever get the trade right now, if they can move their stop loss to break even, if not take over the trade, because the price almost, I mean, it couldn't take the, what, where we have been, what we have been looking for. All right. Now we want to see what's the next, whether this is a correction as what we have here, we can look for this flat. This is what we explained in my last analysis, or we can expect to get the correction and continuation. All right. That's me. You can expect to get the flag. First of all, if you put this top in relative to the previous one, we want to see what we have based on indicators. Okay. If I refer to the MACD, we don't have the divergence, but here we see the divergence. That's why we need to be quite careful. And how about if I refer to the 15 minute? We don't have much information to look for. We don't have the divergence. All right. Okay. Right now, whoever get the trade, as I mentioned, if they can move their stop loss to break even, if not, take over the trade. All right, because the only way having in trip of this, rather than that, there was no other option or based on lower time frame. And still we can expect this one tentative flag for continuation. But even if we want to look for this one next trade from here, we need to know that we need to see the breakout of this zone. If not, still we are looking at this flat, bigger picture for price to drop. And the only times we can confirm this is the start of the down move because the indicator doesn't give us any information. If we see the price drop sharply, turn to a correction flag for as a sell setup, then from there we can look for when we can expect the price to retest the previous low. And this is where we can look for sell. That's mean right now we don't have any trade setup either for buy or sell, and we need to see what we get here. Whether we get the flag for continuation or sharp move, flag for price to drop. Okay, because in the both way we still we can look at the chart. And mostly we're looking for continuation because the price haven't came to this soon yet. Okay. And rather than that, we don't have anything else to discuss. Because if we refer to forward chart based on bigger picture, we mentioned we want we need to be careful about this. And the best thing is if this one turn to a deeper correction similar to what we have here, and this is what we're looking for. This is what we wanted for the long term because one hour chart, what we will discuss right now is the short term. Bro. We want to get one more drop. And then from there, if we get any trade for buy for long term, this is a longer term than one hour chart. This is what we're looking for. Anyway, whoever get the trade, they have to start to manage. And right now we're looking at this correction. We want to see what's the next, whether we should look for buy, continuation, or the price to drop. In this case, we just follow the chart. If I see any update, I will share. Thanks.